up guys this is junior from cr4 if you're hunting welcome back to the channel you guys saw the title you saw the thumbnail you know we're gonna do the 65 original versus the 308 we're gonna dig in here and let you guys take a closer look at what we're gonna be shooting today all right so i'll show you guys what we're gonna be shooting today a couple of the tools that we're gonna be using we do have my 308 a metal set arm the ar10 308 and as you guys can see a couple of videos ago we uh did a budget scope and i still got this cv life on here so i, I wouldn't play on i told you guys this is something that was really really worth using for 50 bucks i still got it on there several months later i've never even taken it off it's a really really good scope and it's been holding zero so show you guys the ammo then i'll go show you jake's brand new 6.5 brindle so here's the ammo we're going to be using this is 145 grain fmj from the 308 and 100 grain fmj from 65 grindle 65 grindles uh, ballistic should be really really close to 308 but obviously you can get out of ar 2 i mean ar 15 so that is the brand new 6.5 grindle just got it today we haven't even fired a shot through yet and we got my atn outfitted on top already so i walk down to show you guys the targets that we will be shooting at today for this penetration test all right, so our penetration test today will be two parts. Uh, no, one, we got this steel that I got a couple of guys to cut up for me. You can see we got a couple of holes in it already. So we'll be taking a shot with the 308 and the 65 Grindle at this to see if uh, either of them can make it through two of these plates. I do not think either of them will, but we'll find out. That's why we run the test. And then we got this level three body armor from RTS Tactical. Thanks, big shout out to those guys for sending this out to us. We got a couple holes in it from an earlier video we did. Uh, there's some stuff that was not rated for this plate to stop, and then obviously it didn't stop it. I did reach out to RTS Tactical, and they are going to send me some level four plates, uh, and I do think it will stop. But we're going to shoot this uh, body armor. Like I said, it's a level three, and see if this will stop the 308, and if it'll stop that 65 Grindel. So that's today's test. Uh, we'll stop talking and get to shoot. Before we shoot, I just wanted to show you guys, we always apologize for the wind, but we're literally right on the water. So every time we shoot, our head our range is always gonna be windy. Anyway, we have a lot of fun. Just wanted to let you guys know. Okay, first shot, we're about to take with the 6.5 Grindle. All right, on you, Jake. All right, let's go check it out. I think this is your hole right here. Right here, huh, Jake? Nope. That one. That one. All right, so a little lower. So it went through the first wall, uh, and it stopped on the, there we go. So we got a little bulge there on the back side. You can go and yank that out. But it did not go through the second. So it went through the first, and stopped here on the second piece of steel. So let's take out the 308, and, uh, See what results we get. Okay, let's take a shot with the 308 and uh, see what happens. All right, let's go check it out. All right, looks like Jake caught it on the corner here and it did blow through the first one, just like our 65 Grindle, but it did not make it through the back side. So we do have a a little bit bigger of a bulge here on the back side, but just like the 6.5 Grindle, neither of them made it through both plates. So let's take out uh, this RTS Tactical Level 3 body armor. We'll get it set up here and take a couple shots at it. All right, we got that uh, Level 3 plate set up from RTS Tactical. We'll take a shot with the 6.5 Grindle and see if we can get through that plate. All right, Jake. All right, well, you guys can see there, this is where he caught it, and barely a little little indention there, but obviously it didn't go through. Still only got two holes in this. I won't spoil it and tell you guys what did make it through, but it, this plate was not ready for uh, the two rounds that made it through. So this plate has successfully stopped everything that we've put through it. Uh, it's really, really good, uh, good quality. I uh, definitely recommend you guys checking out RTS Tactical. We'll take out the 308 now and this full metal jacket and uh, see what happens. 
Okay, let's take this shot with the 308. This is 145 grain FMJ and uh, see what happens with this plate. All right. It definitely sounded like it hit that plate a little harder than me. But, let's go check it out. All right, we smacked it right here. Maybe a little bit uh, bigger of an indention than the 6.5 Grindle, but at the end of the day, Play held up. Hey Jay, can you yank that out? Show him the back side. End of the day, it held up. Still got our two holes from our other two rounds, but nothing, no, not even any dimpling. Flip it back over for me. Uh, as you guys can see, uh, RTS Tactical did the trick again. This uh, body armor from RTS Tactical is really, really good stuff. I'll leave a link down in the description where you guys can go check out RTS Tactical and get a little discount with my discount code. Appreciate you guys checking out this video with the 65 Grindle and the 308. We have a lot more videos coming with those two uh, really, really soon. Junior, out.